Well, an upcoming event helps support families in Western Kentucky and Southern Illinois who have a child diagnosed with cancer. That's right, and it's just Imagine Childhood Cancer Walk. And it's being put on by Book for Hope. Now, Brooke Slyer is live this morning in Paducah with more details, Brooke. Yeah, good morning, Evie and Dave. Well, that event that you just mentioned will be taking place here at the McCracken County High School in September. And joining me again this morning is Galen Hayden. She is the organizer of the walk as well as the founder of Book for Hope. So obviously money raised from this walk will go to Book for Hope and further your guys' cause. So why don't you go ahead and fill in the viewers on at home about what you all do? Well, we raise childhood cancer awareness. We financially support families in Southern Illinois and Western Kentucky that have a child that's on cancer treatment. We also give 32% to childhood cancer research. So that's our mission and that's what we do. And we give an emergency envelope in the very beginning of a child being diagnosed and we get an application back from a pediatric oncology social worker. They get a $250 emergency envelope and then the next month they can submit a bill to our organization it's in their name and we will pay one bill a month as long as they, that child is on cancer treatment. And I know that really helps out the families who have to travel to those appointments, take off uh, time from work for those appointments. And you did mention uh, just briefly that some of the money goes toward childhood cancer research which is really important because only I believe about 4% about goes to that. So yeah. go ahead and fill us in on some of these stats. Actually, it's uh, 3.9 something, but everyone always rounds it off to 4%. Uh, that is given, that's a, the NIH, of course, is a federal uh, funded agency, federal government. So they give 4% um, to childhood cancer research. So childhood cancer research is very important because adults such as myself receive 96% of funding from the federal government and kids 4% funding. We just think that that's a great disparity between the two and there needs to be more. So we're trying to do our part in helping. Absolutely, and by coming out to this walk, you go ahead and further that mission. We'll talk a little bit more about that coming up later on the show, but for now, Evie and Dave, back to you.